So let's talk a little bit about authorization and really the surrounding principle of least privilege access. So some practical tips to think about at this stage is one, a practice we deem really important here at Jump Cloud, and it's to maintain a access control matrix. So think across your company, documenting departments, the roles within each department, the permission levels that those users need, even down to specific application requirements. So this practice will help ensure users are not overprivileged. So some like examples to think about, you don't want a junior software developer having full admin privileges to your production AWS account, as an example. So diligent work on this access control matrix will make sure that employees have the correct access to do their job, but they're not overprivileged. So following that principle of least privilege access. Some further, hopefully practical tips on the authorization component is uh, your ability to define attribute values for these roles, which can really help aid in automation. And as Lindsay mentioned, this can actually even stem from the beginning HR process. So when an identity provider can pass along attribute information on a user to the end you know, application or service provider, this can help drop employees in the right role, right permissions without that manual step. So hopefully a practical tip there. Further, just really kind of company communication and something that we find really useful is setting up a reoccurring cadence with department leaders. Uh, as organizations are growing, teams are changing, reporting structure, it's good to have a repeating cadence to make sure that you understand what applications departments are using, roles, permission levels. So look for someone who has great attention to detail in each of these departments. Uh, you know, could be conducted as often as once a month or a, a cadence you see relevant. So those are some practical tips on the authorization component. Please subscribe and check out more content from us.